welcome back to more Spy X Familia. I am here with my reaction to episode four of The Dub. You guys, the comment section, the comment section, the comment section, the last episode. Oh, the comment section, the last episode. And funnily enough, it was nothing to do with me, what I'm wearing, how I look. It was also nothing to do with like, anything that happened in the show. It was just people whinging that it wasn't in Japanese and I'm like, you know what, guys? I'm gonna take my phone and I am exiting, okay? Maybe this way or this way. God! It drives me insane. <clears throat> mm -hmm. it drives me insane. The thing about anime, um, not anime in general, but like a lot of the people who watch it on YouTube, I feel like they don't care about the YouTuber. Oh, I feel a Susie rant coming. I feel it. I feel like it's coming. Oh, let's let it out. Let's let it out. It's a, it's Sunday. I'm filming this. You, you guys will probably get it Monday, but like, it's a new week. So let's get it off our chests. It was kind of similar in gaming where if you're playing a popular game, a lot of the time they weren't there for you. Like I used to play games early. I used to like get them early and people were there a lot of the time just to see if they wanted to buy the game, but they stuck around afterwards. Okay. What I'm finding with the anime stuff is that it feels sometimes like the people watching and if this isn't you, that's great. Thank you so much. But if it is you, it feels like a lot of the time people watching, they don't actually care about you. <laughs> and I feel like it's reflected in the views a lot of the time where basically you can have a video that'll get like a hundred thousand views and then the next one will get like 10. And you're like, where's these middle people? Where's the other 90,000 people? And it's because they don't care about you. Okay, let's just... Yeah, let's just take that in for a second. And I feel like a lot of reactors know this, but it's still shitty, to be honest with you. So I, I'm i going away for a little bit. I'm going traveling and I'm ready. I'm so ready for this travel. Um, I've gone through a lot with my face. It still hurts constantly. Even if I'm talking to you guys right now, it's pissing me off. And um, I'm starting to feel like... And I'm not going to say if things don't change, because they won't. Like, I know they won't. I feel like I'm ready for a content revamp. So when I left gaming to start doing anime, it was because the Naruto stuff was doing really well and I was enjoying it. It was something new. It was fresh. And now that that's been like two and a half, almost three years, I'm ready for a, a content revamp. Like, I do this. That's how I kind of stay in the game a little bit longer. And I think I'm ready to do content where I feel like people come for me instead of like, what anime show is that? And then I'm kind of getting sick and tired of like starting a new show and someone else being like, no, I don't want this one. I want this one. So I'm not coming back because they don't care about you. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I, I just feel like I'm getting bored of that and um, I accomplished a lot in gaming. Like I got to showcase a lot of like games and stuff like that, like on stages around the world. And I feel like with anime, it's not really taking me anywhere. Yeah, I don't know. So I'm going traveling and I'm going to have a really long, hard think about this. Yeah, I just don't know. That's my rant. That's like a four minute intro. But uh, yeah, I just don't know where my head's at right now in regards to anime, because I feel like people don't care. Yeah. Where did that come from? <laughs> Anyways, if you made it this far in, let's just get on with Spy X Familia. I am really enjoying this show, by the way. It's, um, I love Anya, she's a cutie, and I love the dynamic between the three of them, and I'm really excited for things to just pop off. Cause you know it's gonna, you know it's gonna, right? Let's do it. 
If you want to watch this video unedited, make sure you head on over to my website, suzylou.co.uk and become a VIP member. VIP members get access to all the videos early. They also get access to VIP only series. They get access to my VIP only discord. So nobody else is allowed into my discord. Only VIPs are allowed in there. And of course the VIPs will get a shout out in my videos. We have a VIP of the day so i hope to see you over there and how will you be speaking today like this please got it please <laughs> god it's like a mission impossible dun, 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 dun. i mean i don't know if that's how mission impossible goes to be fair but onward to the we Eden got College this interview. the prestigious schools interview and there are so many applicants you mean rivals Rivals! Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. We're not the only ones being watched. It's unpleasant regardless. Oh. Wait, so who's gotcha. watching Number all of us? Overhead. Oh, they're stalking us. I've gathered intel on the majority of the staff at this school, and who's watching are the instructors. They're observing every action that each applicant takes and scoring them to see if they're worthy of moving on. Of nonsense okay why are you judging us based on what we're wearing i mean do i look kind of nice so do i a12 fail g114 pass we've some poor examinees this year they all lack any true elegance elegance have you seen your tash you sir crude feet <laughs> are trudging upon the blessed ground of our school elegance is at the root of tradition well, thank you. I like to think that I have some elegance in my days, you know? Oh. I mean, we kind of knew that that was going to be a part of the test anyway. That's why we went shopping in the last episode. My very existence relies on being exactly who my target wants me to be. Like this. I haven't the slightest clue as to who this gentleman is, but if I follow Lloyd's lead, everything will work out, right? Baldy, baldy. <laughs> baldy, baldy, like one punch man. Their daughter Anya just barely passed the written exam with a score of 31. Inelegant in score and in handwriting. Oh. So the father's remarried. Could they be a fake family for the sake of admission? Oh, so this happens quite a lot then, doesn't it? Uh, A12, you're over in Hall 2. They're already classifying us. You're K-212, huh? It's straight ahead to Hall 1. Yeah, the reason they're separating you is because some people have already failed. That's why they're putting the failures over one side. Oh no! I've accidentally fallen into the gutter and now I can't get out! Hmm. Oh, An man. obvious test. Really here. No ah, one's approaching him. They're suspicious too. Oh, but God. if I'm right, then we need to deal with him. Yeah, because it's the right thing to do. Go help the child. <laughs> Precisely. You're heading to an interview. You wouldn't sully your clothes or sewage. Now, how will you elegantly get past the opposite? Oh my god, he didn't care. <laughs> he just, oh my god. Yoink. <laughs> you should go to the nurse just in case. Oh, I expected too much. In the end, they're just some commoners. Commoners? I mean, now we're gonna stink as shit all day, though. That's the issue. Oh, man, these nice people are gonna fail because of me. Hey, I'm, I'm really so- Glad we anticipated this. What would we have done if we hadn't brought a change of clothes with us? Who in their right mind would ever anticipate something like that? <laughs> we're passing this test. We are definitely. We're testing the child? Silence. Children emulate their parents, which means if she's worth 31 points, then so are they. I'll make you reveal your true identity yet. Well, they are definitely on to us. I mean, who doesn't walk around with a change of clothes all the time? A bit much for a test, don't you think? Wait, who let the sheep out? Who? 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 Whose ridiculous idea was this? Wait, it wasn't yours? <laughs> Oh, don't tell me. Is this an actual crisis? No, this isn't a crisis. This is Lloyd doing this. 
I think this is Lloyd. Lloyd! It's happening again. The mass panic must have hit her. I've had it up to here with these tests. Uh We've also had it up to here with the bulls! Watch Anya for a moment. Your? Yes, girl! And she's gonna do it in high heels. Wait, she just put them to sleep, right? She didn't kill them. Miss Cow? Are you scared? Miss Cow? To be fair, I think I would be scared too. Don't be afraid. What did I say? Ah! <laughs> Wait, do we have a third change of clothes? Because now we smell of cows. Such a hell! Stop it! This guy is obsessed. Just pass us already! Return to the hall once you've had a moment to tidy yourselves. After today, your family has the right to apply to our school. Oh. Sir? Looks like we haven't failed just yet. I think he likes us. He's very much obsessed with the elegance. We anticipated this. And prepared another change of clothes. <coughs> oh, this is no longer about elegance. These people are just scary. But does he not think, though, that maybe that they are a fake family because they're so prepared? Bit suspicious. I'm actually nervous. I've gone undercover in a dangerous terrorist organization. I've stopped a nuclear missile from launching with only one second left on the countdown. Wait, I needed to see that mission. That one looks really interesting. The Forgers. Here. Yeah. There's no doubt. This is the most crucial moment of Operation Strix. Come on, Anya, you've got this. All you gotta do is listen to Lloyd and he'll guide you through, even though he doesn't know he's doing that. We usually like to start these off by asking a few questions to the parents. The housemaster of Malcolm Hall, the fifth dorm. Mild-mannered, sincere, and conservative. He does have a really, like, nice face, though. He seems like he'd be such a kind gentleman. It's a guy with a weird beard that I'm worried about. Having lost my first wife and with a daughter to take care of, I was hesitant to pursue a new relationship. But the more we spoke, the more I knew we were kindred spirits. She's like sitting there, she's like, oh, I hope that he's being sincere, but I know it's all an act, I know. And he's quite considerate of me as well. Hmm, I'm happy to hear you have such an affectionate family. Why would an attractive young woman such as you even want to marry a man with baggage? That was rather uncouth. I mean baggage, but have you seen Lloyd? He is hubba hubba, okay? The former headmaster and a legacy hire. Arrogant, greedy, and callous. His wife filed for divorce last month, and he just lost custody of his daughter as well. Ah, so he's gonna be a really happy man with family values. Could you tell us why it is you chose to apply to our school? For one reason, to get close to my target, Desmond. The instructors at this establishment are second to none. <laughs> I live for that, for one reason only, because I really don't want to have to do this. <laughs> I see. I would love to hear one of you describe your daughter in your own words next. Oh, she is adorable, but she hates crowds. I suppose one could argue that her nosy nature is a weakness, but it stems from her intelligence. Her intelligence? <laughs> Sometimes she sees right through me, and I'd swear she's reading my mind. It keeps me on my toes. It's like, how does he know? How does he know? <laughs> Your husband just mentioned your daughter's a bit of a picky eater, which begs the question, what kind of meals do you cook at home? Sausages and mash with peas. I actually do most of the cooking. Of course, when I'm too busy to, my wife's kind enough to fill in for me. Not that that's ever happened. You're joking! What kind of wife doesn't even cook for her husband? I don't! I am never in the kitchen! She is extremely tidy and keeps our house spotless. She's also an excellent mother to my daughter. Yes, well, those are all things I'd hope a woman would excel at, don't you agree? Oh, the chauvinistic pig! Why are you getting so irritated, Twilight? I mean, she's not even your real wife. Oh, someone's catching the Fifi's. I'll just keep jabbing away at them until they slip up. If these smug idiots don't fail, there's no justice in the world. He doesn't like Papa and Mama. I gotta pick up the slack. Go on, Anya, you know what's what. What would you like to do once you get into the school? I, uh, maybe, what 
Oh no, come on, Anya! Get to Desmond, boss of the enemy organization, at a social gathering and find out what he's planning. I'll find out what the organization boss is planning! Wait, what is she saying? Oh my god! Oh my god! No, 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 no! Shh, 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 shh. Wow, Anya! Hmm. How about this? Do you truly understand how hard one has to work to succeed as he has? Just say yes! Yes, 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 yes! Such incredible resolve! It appears I've underestimated this young lady! Oh, so elegant! <laughs> what does your father do for a living? He's a spa. Father's a spectacular psychiatrist! A little stuffed up, are we? Poor thing. <sighs> he must know! He must know! If I were to ask you to give your parents a score, what would it be? Out of anything? A perfect hundred points! They're so much fun, and I love them very, very much. I want to be with them forever. Oh, and I don't think that's a lie as well. Oh, did you see Between their faces? Between your new and old mother, who would you give a higher score? Master Swan. Excuse me, you do not answer that. I don't know how she ended up in that orphanage, but there's a good chance her parents are. <gasps> you made her cry! Wow. Mommy. Well, that answers that. So you do prefer your old mother. Wow, this is not okay. This is not fucking okay. If that brought her to tears, she'll never survive at our establishment. Who cares if he's being slanderous? I care that he's being slanderous. This needs to stop. Oh, Mrs. Second Wife, don't snap at me just because she loves you less. Now I feel better. Hmm? No, 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 no. Twilight. <laughs> I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done that, but you shouldn't have said what you just said. If this is what you call education, belittling a child's feelings like that, then we've chosen the wrong school. <gasps> what? Wow. We just flipped on you, sir. Master Swan, that is quite enough. Are you taking issue with my processes? Yes, I am taking issues with your processes. What the fuck was that? He was not the one who disgraced our school today. Huh? Oh! Ah! Well, good. I'm glad that he got the punch that he deserved. And with that, I can face you with the pride of an Eden College educator. Forgers. So we failed them because we didn't actually get into the school. Like, what happens now? But I do want to go to school. Because if your mission fails, I have to go to school there. We won't be together anymore. Oh, and you cannot get rid of Anya. I'm sure it'll be okay. Everything will work out. <gasps> the grandpa with the glasses and the grandpa with the half glasses were really nice. Yes, exactly. I know they'll vouch for us. We just have to believe. Okay, so I know that we were the ones that walked out, but there is a chance that he'll want us back. For now, I'll just enjoy this. <gasps> to our family's bright future. Aw, so... Oh, oh. That doesn't seem like a good omen. No, that doesn't seem like a good omen. What does that mean? No! Is that... That's the end? Oh, man. Do you know what I love about this show? We're only on episode four and already you're seeing Lloyd for one. He was so like, oh my God, she's crying. And he put the mission in jeopardy because they made Anya cry. You know what I'm saying? Like the best of the best. And that's what I really like about this show. And there's a lot of people who are already complaining like, Oh, there's not enough action for me. I thought they, this show was going to be kind of filled with action and things like that. But I really like the pacing of this. Yes, okay, sometimes there is action. But it's more like spy drama, would you say? Would that be the right thing to, to call this? Like already I'm sitting here and I'm like, I want this family to be together. I want them to be a real family for each other. For everything that all three of them have gone through. But mainly for Anya. Yeah, I need to see it. I need to see it. That guy, God. I know that 
his wife left him and he doesn't get to see his kid and la 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 la. But I mean, you're in the wrong job then, are you not? Considering that you're trying to take in the best of the best, so elegant and all of that kind of stuff. And you're not elegant yourself. You're in the wrong job, clearly. But he got a punch and I guess we'll find out in the next episode if we actually um, continue with the mission or if we're gonna have to, you know, make some adjustments to the mission. Yeah, that was a good episode. And as per usual, it was over far too quickly. I was like, no, 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 I, I need more. I need more. But because I'm watching the dub, I have to wait. I know episode five is available for the Japanese, but it is what it is. And I will catch you guys next week. And then I think that's going to be the last one I'm watching. And then I go traveling and then... I'm gonna have like a ton of these to watch when I come back. So yeah, I'm only gonna get up to episode five and then it's practically gonna be like episode 10 for me or something crazy like that. So I'm gonna miss this show. No spoilers, say nothing, okay? Say nothing. Thank you so much for watching my reaction to this and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.